What is up guys? Welcome to another episode of Online Product Reviews Manila. Before we continue, I would like to give thanks to all my subscribers out there. Thank you so much for all the likes, views, comments, suggestions. Thank you so much for supporting my channel. I really do appreciate it. So, what I have for you today is the Ishin E011. It's a toy grade drone with lots of potential. This drone is completely customizable. What I mean about customizing is that you can install an FBV camera, upgrade different kind of high milliamp batteries, motors, flight control board, props, everything. Parts and accessories for upgrades are massive in online stores, so you won't be able to have a hard time upgrading one. This toy grade drone is a good platform to start with. I bought it for 890 pesos. That's about $18 in the US. I've put a link on the description below where I bought it, so please do check that out. We'll be unboxing this and have a flight review later on. So let's get into it. So here's the box, nicely packed. You have two choices, the Dark Knight and the Bright Saint. I chose the blue one because it's kind of cool, you know, white and blue combination. So what we have inside, we've got here the quadcopter, the controller, accessories, battery, battery charger, and the instruction manual. This drone has 716 60,000 RPM cordless brushed motors, and it weighs 26.5 grams. The battery is a 1S 3.7 volts, 260 milliamp, good for 5 to 6 minute flight time. So here's the USB battery charger. Plug it to your laptop or power bank or any socket that requires USB adapter. Charging time about 15 minutes. And here's the controller. You'll be needing three AAA batteries to power it up. Quick tutorial with this controller. This is the power switch. Indicator light, left stick, fly, land, pan left and pan right. Right stick of the controller, hover left, right, Fly forward, fly backward. We have here the tuning buttons. Depends on how you calibrate your quad. Mostly on ready to fly versions, you don't need to tune it because it's factory calibrated. This is the speed button. You've got two mods, 40 and 100% power. So let's fly this quadcopter and see how it goes. What I love about this drone is the performance, very responsive and accurate. Flying time is about 5 to 6 minutes max. This drone has headless mode, but I'm not a big fan of it. Oops, sorry. <laughs> the frame is really impressive. It's sturdy and I love how it protects the props from crash and bumps. Maybe it's more responsive if you put out the Lego man on top of it and have more battery life. On my next video, we'll be upgrading this toy grade drone into an FPV drone. Cheapest tiny whoop that you can customize. Again, if you like the video, hit that like button. And if you're interested in my channel, please do subscribe. So see you next time right here on Online Product Reviews Manila.